Hello everyone, this is Kevin with Balan Brands and today I'm going to show you how to create a Google Analytics account. Google Analytics is a widely used web analytics service that tracks and reports website traffic, including the number of visitors, the pages visited, the time spent on the website, geographic location of site visitors, and much more. To begin, visit google.com analytics and sign in using your Google account. If you don't have a Google account, create a new one and verify it using an existing email address. After signing into Google Analytics, click the Sign Up button. Complete the information on the Sign Up form. Under What Would You Like to Track, choose Website. Enter a name for your Google Analytics account. Now set up your first property. If you have multiple websites, each website is considered a separate property. When entering your website URL, be sure to enter it in the same format as your primary domain. For example, if your website has an SSL certificate installed, choose the HTTPS protocol from the drop-down menu. If your website's primary domain does not include the www, then omit this when typing the URL here. Choose an industry category and a reporting time zone. Read through the data sharing settings and choose the settings you're most comfortable with. When finished, Click Get Tracking ID, review the Terms of Service Agreement, and click I Accept. The next page will display your global site tag. This piece of code should be added to the head element of your website so that it appears on every page of the site that you wish to track. If you have a Brew website from Balan Brands, you can add the code to your website by going to Brew Head Footer Scripts. Paste the code into the Head Scripts box and save the changes. Other WordPress themes may also have a place for you to add this code. Check your theme's documentation for more information. As an alternative, you can use a plugin such as Head and Footer Scripts, or if you're familiar with WordPress development, you can use the WP Head hook. After the code has been placed on your website, refresh the tracking code page in Google Analytics and click the Send Test Traffic button to verify that the code is working. For more great videos and tutorials, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful, and we'll see you next time.